What's up guys? So today we're gonna go grab a 1964 Jaguar X-Type that's about an hour and a half from here. I found it on Marketplace scrolling just like any car guy does and I seen that it's been on there for about two months and I knew this guy could use some help. It's been covered in dust since the 1990s. We're gonna get it cleaned up to its full potential so the right buyer does see it and buys it. This money is going to a good cause so stay tuned to see what it's going to. This is gonna be an awesome video. Hope you guys enjoy and make sure that you are subscribed. Yeah, it took us a minute to find the place so uh, we're pulling up right now. Here's the guys. How's it going? Dane. Dane, Mike. Mike. Yep. Nice to meet you. It's in that uh, pole barn over there. Okay, so I'll just pull out. forward a little yeah, and then okay. leave it right here. Well, we're on location, so let's go check out the car. Sure, let's go. Oh, wow. location with the Jaguar with Charles here. I got a few questions for you, Charles. How sure. long has this car been sitting here? We guess from sometime in the mid 90s. And who owns the car? You own the car? The, uh, the Little Travers Conservancy owns the car. Do you know much about the car? We did is? a little bit of research, acquired the property in 2020. So this is an old, old golf course. The previous owner just left it on site and you know, we, we it's been stored here and we were looking to try to get rid of it because yeah. we'd like to open the space for you know, more productive things than right. just an old car. The proceeds from the sale of the car are gonna to go to the Conservancy. It'll be used for further our mission of right. land protection in Northern Michigan. Probably put some information in the description or something if anybody's interested in the car. Hopefully we can help sell this car. Still got some work ahead of us, so let's get this car moving. We're gonna hook it up with some chains. We're gonna pull it right on out of here and then uh, load it up in the trailer. Now's the fun part. That's good. This tire out of here, real quick. It's a freaking round La Cruz again. So, that good cameraman? Oh, is it locked? Oh, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna crank it to the right, it'll bump off that. Pop it. So is this wheel just flat or? Yeah, she just ain't got no dang air, that's a problem. We'll get her moved out a little bit more and then uh, see if that one will hold air. Oh, oh, what are you guys doing here? All right, we're good. All right, I think we cleared all that. Well, the tire's flat. We're gonna pump her up so it's a lot easier. We weren't able to pump it up when it was squeezed up against the wall there, so. Oh, how old is that? I can't get out of the car. Get out. What happened? Automatic jack. There's a mount right here. I think I can get it in its original mount. Did right oh, over on this set. Idea. Yeah. She rolls so good now. Almost want to get in it in case. All right, then we'll move it forward a little. Right. I think that's good right there. God dang car doesn't want to turn. All righty, I'm gonna move the trailer forward. See how we line up. I'll say if we do need reinforcements, I can make a phone call. Yeah, it might be handy. <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll call and see who's available. <laughs> Hi, Keisha. Could you do me a favor? Anyone that is available can come up here and help us push this Jaguar into the trailer. We got back up and we're gonna push this car in here because uh, me and Mike alone weren't gonna do it. This <laughs> thing's a pig. I think uh, right now we're lined up. I'm gonna steer right now and push. Oh, hold on one second. <sighs> I wasn't prepared. <laughs> Are we look good on that side? Yep. Your side? Cool. Yep. All right. I'm gonna straighten it now. Keep going a little. I think we're okay. Let me put her in park. Spider Central in here, dude. Spider's been growing since 1990. All right. Tension there. Oh my god, look at this. Golden. What is that? What is that? Tear. 
There's something dead in there, dude. It's an entire dead mouse in there, dude. I think it's awesome. All right, we got her all loaded. Now we're gonna take her all the way back to Traverse City and get her all cleaned up. Yeah, thanks for helping load, dude. So now we're back to the shop. I'm gonna get the car unloaded and then we're gonna take a better look at it now that it's uh, in the shop. And uh, I see already underneath of it, as we're going down the road, there's a, a rat's nest that came out of the engine bay right there. Since I'm not fancy and I don't have a winch, I'm gonna have to uh, keep blocking it so that she doesn't take off. <laughs> Sorry, slipping? Oh, it's just slipping. Whoop. 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 I'm taking air out of the tire. That'll slow the car down. I'm not. Hernia. Oh, there she goes. Oh, God. Right. We finally got the car out of the trail. I don't have a winch, so we did some redneck uh, engineering and we got it out. It actually rolled a lot slower than I thought. I might have overthought a little bit. Just gonna punch that dent real quick and then uh, call it a day and then come back to get this thing all washed up. So obviously there's a big issue with this car. There's a dent in the hood. Uh, I'm gonna take a couple minutes here real quick and just punch it and see what I can get out of it just from the inside. Here she comes. Oh, God, man, that hurt. Oh. Ah, there we go. Yeah. Well, look at that. It's like a dent never even happened. We got some paint peeling, some rust that looks like when that dent popped in, peeled this paint off, so it's been rusting. Probably take care of that a little bit and uh, touch it up just to make it look better. This carpet's all ripped up. It looks like the mice chewed it or his foot just really got to it. A little bit of mold on the seats. I don't see the dash. It doesn't look like there's a dash up there or anything. Let's check what we got in the back seat. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff in the back seat. It's this TV week, 1978, section 10. That's an old classic. It's pretty cool. Oh, look at that. We got the dash. It's real wood too. I don't know why the guy took it off and preserved it. I don't know if he did that in the 90s when he parked it. Yeah, it looks like there's a bunch of parts and they're all real wood. Let's pop the trunk, see what's in here. It's actually pretty clean. Look at that spare wheel, it's like almost brand new. Jumper cables and some uh, old tire pump. Even the old Jaguar manual, it looks like. Jaguar Mark 10 model, operating maintenance and service handbook. Pretty neat. It's a never ending rat's nest down here in the fender. Now what I'm spraying on here right now is an iron remover. It's gonna remove any contaminants, brake dust, any iron that is stuck to the surface of the car. This will break it all down and make it easy to wash.
Charles here. We got the Jaguar all cleaned up. So let's show you the car and uh, get it rolled out. It's like opening a prison. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> oh my goodness, the chrome on that. That is wild. Wow, you did yeah. a great job. Pull her out so you can take a better look at it. came out as best as it possibly can sure. for being oh, yeah. so yeah, just awesome. dry and um, what it is you know shampoo oh, carpets as best as they come you might actually right. go in there now yeah, yeah you could you could sit in there yeah. <laughs> so yeah you could actually sit in it um, like i said all the wood trim goes on top of these doors makes it look awesome the glove box it has also on the back of the seats it has uh wood tables that fold down with mirrors oh. Oh, they're wow. all in the trunk it's actually a very fancy car and it's, it's all here. And you know, like you said, I don't think we'll have a problem selling it. Yeah, you could see it through the windows. You could actually we, see We it. had it on Facebook Marketplace for two or three months. Yeah. And I only had one person. They yeah. really lowballed me on it. Right. I mean, well. And I was about to take the offer, and then you came in and was like, hey, you know, I'll clean this up. And, you know, I think yeah. it's, you know, really going to, you know, improve the value of it. And yeah. <laughs> that guy's bumming that. And if you guys are interested, just go in the description and you could purchase this car. You know, and the proceeds go to the Little Travers Conservancy and help us uh, conserve more land here in northern Michigan. So. Right. Which is great. Well, Charles, it was a pleasure. Thank you very we're gonna much. We're going to head on back out of here and uh, we're going to get the next one loaded up and do another one. So appreciate you guys watching. Stay tuned for next week and I'll catch you guys on the next detail. Oh, that's cool. That's yeah. All the original Jaguar tools and stuff. And they even say Jaguar on the tools if you look on one side. <laughs> it's pretty neat. <laughs>